I'm not sure how to do this video because you, you you saw the video yesterday and if you didn't then go watch it it's fairly important <laughs> it is very important actually this whole situation is just fucked and because of how fucked it is I'm going to have to change the entire channel maybe not for the better but I have to do something to avoid going to prison I, I could go to jail for talking about comic books that's how ridiculous this this whole situation is it's not it's not the fact of your content is directly aimed towards kids it's not a fact of oh you you swear in your videos so that's that's fine you're not you're not aiming aiming your content towards kids it's the fact of spider-man's in the thumbnail so automatically towards kids we're not we're we gonna watch your video no no we don't care about the content that you create we care about what you we care about what the title of your video is and we care about the thumbnail and what's on that and are you doing a video about comic books yes then it's for kids it's not are you doing a video about comic books yes are they violent are they max are they punisher are they ghost rider are they blade are they more violent than your usual typical comic books are your comic books aimed towards an adult audience or a kid audience those questions won't be asked it will just be comic books for kids boom done <laughs> and it's happening to action figure review channels it's happening to every fucking channel on the platform could be a at risk every single channel on this platform is at risk and no one of no is talking about this you could say yeah Jacksepticeye Jacksepticeye is not going to be affected he's too he's making too much money no he's not he's a drop in the bucket YouTube is a platform with so many creators on it and so many people who who make money towards the towards the platform they could PewDiePie's channel could get shut down tomorrow and they wouldn't give a shit they wouldn't give two shits we would us as viewers would but YouTube will just be like oh yeah sorry there's nothing we can do Here's a bot text uh, response. That's something I'm not even going to get if I decide to speak up about this. I'm not going to get that. If I if I try and at YouTube at Team YouTube on on Twitter or anything, I'm just going to get blocked. I'm not I'm not going to get anywhere, any semblance of anywhere. Because I don't, I don't have a following. I don't have money. I don't have anything. And YouTube isn't allowed to give legal advice on this situation either. They can't take responsibility for something that they fucked up on. They fucked up real bad, and us content creators have to take the flack for it. Why? Why? I, I honestly don't get this whole situation it it's a problem that YouTube needs to deal with and instead of and instead of being like oh all of our channels are now going to be at risk and our, our entire platform could die that's how bad this is YouTube could die next year because of because of this implementation and I'm not I'm not talking about 
oh just toy review channels just comic book review channels PewDiePie is at risk he makes videos on Minecraft what is Minecraft's target audience kids ninja what's ninja's target audience kids because he plays Fortnite Ali A plays Fortnite that's targeting a younger demographic that will be seen as for kids e.g. Ali A comments disabled PewDiePie comments disabled PewDiePie 42 grand fine per violation how many Minecraft videos has he uploaded now that's a lot of that's a lot of money to be fined for playing a video game just just think about that people could go to prison for playing video games people could go to prison for talking about transformers people could go to prison for talking about spider-man i could go to prison for the for the simplest thing as having a poster of baby group in my background so i'm going to i'm going to have to change drastically my entire content everything maybe not everything but i'm going to have to change a lot of stuff on this on this channel i can't talk about comic books anymore i i can't I I just can't. There's too much at risk. Uh, as much uh, as much as I as much as I sound like a drama queen, I don't want to lose that comment section. I don't want to lose the community that I've made. And if I lose that, I I can say, oh, uh, look at my Twitter. But if I have no if I have no notifications on if my notifications aren't going through, if my if like targeted ads on a thing. Well, my videos aren't advertised anyway, but if I do get to 1k and I do manage to get targeted ads or just ads in general, then they will be taken down immediately if I continue the way I am. I, I can't continue uploading the content that I make because it's going to be seen as kid-friendly content and it's going to be buried. And as a rising starting YouTuber, I've been doing this for two fucking years. And I've, I, all I want is 1K so I can start streaming again. And I can't do that. I, I will not be able to make 1K. If I continue making the content that I want to make, if I continue talking about comic books, if I continue to... If I continue to talk about nerd culture, geek culture, I will never make 1K. I may end up being fined a lot of money that I can't afford. I may end up having to go to court when I can't afford a lawyer. Not, so I'll get a shitty one that will not know what they're doing and I'll end up in prison all for talking about comic books so I'm gonna have to change everything I do on this channel so the comic books will be gone the, the talking about video games that will be gone um, the comedy show videos they can stay they they will be staying um, boy boy eats boy eats will stay that's going to be a predominant amount of my on my channel. Uh, food reviews will be the the main bulk of what I'm going to be doing. It was a bulk of it was a bulk of my audience anyway that was watching that. I I can't really I can't really say that this is having an adverse effect on me when no one was watching the uh, the comic book review channel uh, the comic book review videos anyway. But. The content that I I created this channel solely for. The reason why I created this channel. That's going to die next year. 
that's the long and short of it that's going to die next year I can't do that anymore I I'm rambling now because I'm emotional and I really really wanted this I this uh, the reason why I started this was a to get a chance to go to Comic Con like I can't afford a ticket to Comic Con I just I I can't afford a ticket to go to Comic Con but I always I always wanted to go so I thought maybe get uh, get a few people to watch me on YouTube I might end up being uh, being asked to go to Comic Con I wanted to meet Stan Lee but unfortunately he died which was no one's fault but he he died before I got a chance to meet him and I got a comment from a uh, from a girl saying how much my content made her smile made her laugh and that means more to me than going to comic con that means more to me than meeting stanley that means more to me than anything that i can do for for my own self pleasure that the fact that I'm, i i can bring joy to someone else that means the world to me it means more than the world to me so i'm not going to do any fancy editing in this video I'm not going to edit it at all. I'm not going to touch it. And what watch through the whole thing. the The new thing that the new thing that's coming up is lunch with Luke. That's that's a thing that I wanted to do for a while, but it feels like I'm going to have to do it prematurely. Um, it's going to be a, a podcasty type dealio. I don't know what it's going to be quite yet. All I've the only kind of stuff that I've put any thought into is I'm going to be talking about a topic whilst eating food at the same time. So essentially, it's going to be a mukbang uh, type thing. But it's going to be all about talking. It's going to be more about the topic that I'm talking about than eating a crazy amount of food. So it might might just end up being me with a sandwich and a cup of tea, just you know, rambling about stuff like this. I'll I'll try to intersplice talking about comic book goings on in in that. But as for where the comic book geek culture content is going to go, uh that's going to go on my Patreon. I'm going to put uh comic book reviews and comic book haul videos. I'm going to put comic book haul videos onto my Patreon. They're all going there, and comic book reviews are going to go onto Twitch. I'm going to live stream all of my comic book reviews. Uh, I will put gaming stuff over on my Twitch. And yeah, that's essentially it. There's not much more that I can I can really say. So my chat and my channel might disappear next year. My channel might not. This decision to stop doing geek culture content as a priority on this channel may may be my uh, may be the worst decision I've ever made. Maybe the best decision I've ever made, but it's the only decision I can make, really. It's it's the only thing that I can do. I'm gonna 
fucking sucks. It really fucking sucks. 